So let's take five seconds, the fraction five over two, and convert this to a decimal. So when we look at it, we see five is greater than two. So our answer is going to be greater than one. Two times two is four, so somewhere around two. And you could put this in a calculator, five divided by two, and get your answer. Let's do it longhand, though. Let's say we have five, and we want to see how many times two goes into five. Two times two, we said that was four. So it's pretty close. We have one as our remainder. But two doesn't go into one. So what we can do is we could put a decimal point here and put a zero here. And now five times two, that's 10, subtract no remainder. So in answer to our question, the fraction five seconds, that equals the decimal 2.5. These are the same thing, just written differently, same value. That's it. This is Dr. B writing the fraction five seconds as a decimal. Your answer is 2.5. Thanks for watching.